So essentially, we've grown our smaller learning communities uh, up from the freshman to the sophomore year. We had a decision to make. Do we add junior year next year, or do we add juniors and seniors? Knowing that if we added juniors and seniors, those seniors would have never been in the houses. Uh, that was a very conscious choice, an important one. We, we decided to add both at the same time. Open up to your warm-up section. To ease the transition of his right juniors in into the houses the following year, 11th grade English teacher Marty Roberts devotes a unit on nonfiction writing to material relating to small learning communities. I noticed with my juniors a great deal of fear and confusion and um, lack of understanding about what it will mean to be in a smaller learning community here at Hillsdale. They're juniors, so they, they've been in a normal high school structure for the last two years. So we put together this project to both inform them and then to inform other juniors who are not part of my class. I want you to read your quotation, and each quotation has to do with school reform or possible reasons that we might think about redesigning schools. We've gone and looked at the exact same readings that uh, the principal and teachers here were looking at when they helped design this idea of an SLC for Hillsdale. That's our purpose and our audience, guys, for when we make our presentation and when we do our writing is to students, staff, and families who might want to become more informed about this project.